motivation to entrepreneurship. Oh my god. She's hot and she knows about LinkedIn Sales Navigator. And this is a secret tip video and I want to comment this yeah, as a specialist myself about uh, new business generation channel. So if you haven't already hit subscribe and turn post notifications on if you want to get new alerts when I upload a new video. Now, today I come with a very important, highly requested video, which is how I generate leads using Sales Navigator and how I actually convert those leads into paying clients using a secret tool, which I have never mentioned to you guys before. It's actually something that I use personally and that I use with my paying clients. The main reason that I don't speak about everything I do on my channel is just because if people do it in the wrong way and they start using these methods that I teach in terms of outreach, it becomes oversaturated in a bad way. So everyone starts doing the same thing, sending the same messages, but they're not doing it correctly and then it just brings down the trust in our prospects. So that's why I keep a lot of stuff close to my chest. But this tool, I'm gonna to share this with you. It's not super complicated. It's very, very easy and straightforward to use. Now, the first thing I wanna mention is when it comes to lead generation, there are three very important stages that we need to consider. And those three stages are awareness, consideration, and conversion. Now, today I want to mainly focus on awareness and consideration. Um, when it comes to awareness, there are two main ways that this tends to happen. The first way is inbound marketing and the second way is outbound. Now, if you've watched a lot of my content, you'll know that I speak a lot about inbound, um, but today I do wanna to focus on outbound more. And before I get into that, let me just explain the difference. So inbound marketing versus outbound marketing. Outbound marketing is where you go and push a message to a large audience. So you're being the active one, where you're going out and maybe sharing pieces of content or you're messaging somebody directly and saying, hey, this is me, this is what I do, this is my product or service, are you interested? Not in that way, never do it like that, but that's kind of like the gist of it. And then when it comes to inbound marketing, think about your brand or your company being magnetic and attracting your ideal prospects. So inbound is when people are coming to you and saying, hey, um, I saw this piece of content, I just engaged with it, I wanna know more about what you do, please can we jump on a call, that's more inbound. Now, both are super powerful, but the best way to use these strategies is by combining the two and setting up your content strategy and your brand in a way that attracts clients, so via inbound marketing, but also making sure that you've got that tap of leads that you can switch on and off where you can say, okay, if I'm having a month where my inbound lead flow is kind of low, let me go and do some outbound and make sure that I can still hit my revenue goals and my targets for the month. So that's the difference between the two. Today, we are having a heavy focus on outbound. So before we get into it, let me just mention the two different tools that you are going to need to follow along with this video. Now, the first one is, of course, LinkedIn Sales Navigator, one of my favorite tools that I speak about a lot. Now, if you don't have Sales Navigator, don't worry. It looks a little bit pricey initially at $80 per month, but I have an, a, an exclusive free two month trial link for Sales Navigator. You can't even find it on the LinkedIn website. I am affiliated with LinkedIn using this link. So I do get a little bit of a kickback, but you are saving $160. So it's completely up to you if you want to use it or not. Um, I will leave it down below in the description. So two months free, test it out, see if it works well for you. If it doesn't, you can always cancel before the subscription automatically renews. So there's no pressure for it, but I would say get it. Try it out with this method that I'm going to teach you today. 